opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The Sicilian defense controls the d4 square with c-pawn. Nf3 develops the knight toward the center to prepare for a d4 pawn push, where the knight will recapture if black captures on d4. d6 opens up the light squared bishop and prevents white from pushing the pawn to e5 after black eventually plays nf6. d4 offers to trade the d-pawn for the c-pawn, giving up a center pawn for more active pieces. Cx d4 gives black two central pawns versus one central pawn for white. Nx d4 recaptures the pawn and activates the knight in return for having one central pawn versus black's two central pawns. Nf6 develops the knight toward the center and attacks the undefended e4 pawn. Nc3 defends the e4 pawn and starts to develop on the queen side. G6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop on g7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. B3 supports the strong d4 knight in the center. Bg7 puts the bishop on the long diagonal in a move called a fianchetto. F3 supports the e4 pawn, and prepares to develop the dark squared bishop to e3 and the queen to d2, a common attacking setup versus fianchetto systems. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. Qd2 develops the queen, defends the bishop on e3 and prepares to castle queenside. Nc6 develops the knight, attacks the knight on d4 and controls the e5 square. Queenside castling gets the king out of the center, activates the rook and seeks to start an attack on the king's side. d5 takes space in the center and attacks the e4 pawn. x5 captures the d5 pawn and attacks the knight on c6. Nx d5 recaptures the d5 pawn and centralizes the knight. Nx c6 captures the knight on c6 and attacks the queen. Bx c6 recaptures the knight and opens up the b-file. Bd4 centralizes the dark squared bishop and offers to trade black's strong bishop on g7. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. Recaptures. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. This is the only good move. This exposes an attack, threatening a queen. This is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. Takes back. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This is the only good move. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is the last book move. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This forces doubled pawns in front of the opponent's king, decreasing its safety and harming the pawn structure. It is best. Recaptures. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is good. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. The pawn is now adequately defended. It is best. This doubles the rooks onto a single file, which allows them to team up to create threats. It is good. This is the strongest option. It is best. That was a great move and very hard to find. It is brilliant. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. That was a truly amazing move. This is the only good move. This is the start of the end game and white is equal. It is brilliant. This misses an opportunity to reveal an attack on a rook. It is a mistake. This overlooks a better way to move a rook to safety. It is a miss. Black was worse off but now they are in a losing position. It is a mistake. This is a fair move. It is good. White was better off, but now their position is winning. It is an inaccuracy. Very precise. It is best. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. White still has an advantage, but they no longer have a winning position. It is an inaccuracy. 
Black was worse off, but now they are in a losing position. It is an inaccuracy. That's fine. It is good. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. This misses an opportunity to defend a rook that was under attack. This allows the opponent to activate the king by getting it off of the back rank. It is an inaccuracy. Takes back. It is best. This moves the rook to safety. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This threatens to win a rook. It is best. This captures a pawn that checked the king. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Right on target. It is best. This overlooks a better way to evade the check from the opposing rook. It is a mistake. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This move puts the pawn on a safer square. It is excellent. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. Recaptures. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This makes a passed pawn, meaning no opposing pawn can challenge it on its way to promotion. It is good. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is excellent. This is a fair move. It is good. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is good. This is the only good move. It is a great move. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is best. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. This pushes a passed pawn. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. Very precise. It is best. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to use a rook to counter a passed pawn. It is a mistake. This steps away from the checking rook. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. There was only one good move in that position. It is a mistake. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. This misses a chance to obtain a winning position. This misses an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is a miss. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a great move. This evades the check from the rook. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This evades the check from the rook. It is excellent. That's fine. It is good. This reveals an attack on a rook. It is excellent. This moves the rook to safety. It is best. This evades the check from the rook. It is good. Right on target. It is best. This reveals an attack on a rook. It is best. This puts the rook behind an opposing passed pawn, which helps counter the pawn's push to promotion. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This pushes a passed pawn. It is best. That was a free pawn. It is best. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. This puts the rook behind an opposing passed pawn, which helps counter the pawn's push to promotion. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This defends the attacked rook. It is best. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. This threatens to promote a pawn to a queen. It is best. This is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to promote a pawn to a queen. It is a great move. This is the only good move. It is a great move. 
This pushes a past pawn. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. Very precise. It is best. Sharp a back and forth game where both players had chances. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Both players had a nice end game. 